Republic Act 3846, also known as also known as the Radio Control Law. Okay. She had conducted some financial wealth seminar to some companies and educating people about the value of financial planning and the importance of life insurance. So she's into financial wellness and energy and telecommunications. So friends, please welcome Judy. Also, you watching all the world, I didn't know. And one 
uh, effective strategy yung dinodocument yung learnings and then you show it again. Para kapag na encounter nila yung same problem, pwede nila mag-check kung itong strategy mo is mag-reform sa kanila. Additional, pwede rin sila mag-share dun kung ano yung strategy na makakatulong for solving the same concern. So aside from that, nagtitigil kayo ng nalang sa isang isa and mag-government at kasi mas malalaman yung ano yung mga strategies na makakatulong sa the same concern na may encounter. So strategy number four is to empower team members. So effective na maging ma-empower yung team members mo by meaning feeling them feel good about themselves. Like celebrating yung mga small bits nila. So yung simple lang na mag-congratulate mo sila, yung affirmation that they have done a good work, and then to motivate them to keep up with the good work and to keep up the best in them. Another way of empowering or motivation ng yung mga team members natin, yung simple lang na regular lang like right? once a week ka magsasend ng motivational quotes o kaya inspirational, kasi hindi mo alam kung kaya sila may downtime. So lahat tayo na yung pursue ngayon yung mga downtime tayo. And yung simple lang na pag-share natin ng mga messages, would uplift them. Nag-share ko nila. Dali na kung yung messages na yun is nakakalit sila, ay nakita nila na makakatulong ngayon sa kami. Another point is, kapag nag-share ng ideas yung mga team member mo, ay nakita mo din mo kaya siya, you implement the, their ideas. So, doon na kapit nila yung kanilang uh, sense of belongingness at saka yung nakitutulong nila din sa ito ko. And also, um, kailangan din um, magiging ko sa kanila na they have to set kung ano yung goals nila, ano yung specific uh, goals para ma-keep them in ways and make them accountable. So, that's another way to empower the members. strong relationship with team members. So in this stance, this does go by keeping trust and strong relationship with team members ma-overcome ba yun? So paano ba yun? Hindi sa lahat ng bagay puro tungkol sa work mo pwede niyo pag-usapan. Pwede niyo niyo pag-usapan yung mga personal interest. So dapat kilalanin mo yung bawat team members no like interest kung ano yun pag sa mga issues and struggles nila and then mahalagay ko sa nakalaman mo kung ano yung mga differences nyo para alam ko kung paano mo mabibuild yung trust and confidence with them. So building strong relationship is uh, another example nito is then parang kapag nag-organize nyo ko ng mga panel day high care, inihigh ko sila kasi in that way, mas makikilala mo sila kapag makakasama mo sa isang mga fan activities And then, I also encourage you to want someone to have them para kahit pa paano, may meeting din, may personal data. So, mas makikilala mo din sila through mga banding, bali moments, mga activities, and mga hands. So, yung pagiging leader kasi is hindi mo kailangan ito yung pinakamadasyong posisyon. It's enough na namumotivate mo yung people around you or yung team members mo para magawa nila yung best nila at magawa pa nila kung ano yung mga dapat nila mag achieve sa mga task nila. So, to wrap it up, yung distance, we could use or leverage the technology para sa ganun, mag mag matanggal natin yung distance gap, makapag-create tayo ng high-class environment where it could personally communicate with its team members at makilig natin yung interactive uh, communication. So I would like to end my presentation by uh, giving these uh, leadership quotes to live by. So if your actions inspire others to do more, learn more, do more, and become more, you are a leader. Great leaders don't blame the tools they are given, they work to sharpen them. Great leaders find ways to connect with their people and help them fulfill their potential. That's it, thank you.